Okay, this is part three of my empties. I promise you guys, this is the last one. I did finish another one of these Glade. Um, this is how they look. The scented oil, and this is like the two-pack. I finished um, one in, it's called Woodside Library, I believe. It comes in like a blue packaging, and I believe it's, I don't think it's seasonal, but it's a leather and oak fragrance. Did you like this one, baby? Let's just smell it one more time. You remember that one? It's cool. Yeah, it's strong. It actually is really strong. I have one more wax cube in this one. I it's, would... It almost smells like them incense that you burn, like, at the... Like an instant shop or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's really... I mean, it does. It reminds me almost of that smell. I don't know if you guys know it, but, like, the smell of, like, when you go into a library, like, not not an old book smell, but, like, a... Like, it does. It smell has, like, that leathery oak like woodsy type of scent and it's I mean it's really really good I will probably do a review on these because this ended up being one of my favorites I was really hesitant to get it but I absolutely fell in love with it and my husband loves it so I will repurchase this and I actually have some coupons so I'm going to actually pair whatever the sale is I usually get them at Target and I'm going to be getting some more I can usually get them for just a couple of dollars and like I said they last much longer they have the candles in it they have the um, wax melts they have the oils, and I believe they have a room spray as well. Um, I would definitely get all of them. Um, I've tried the, I haven't tried the candle, but I've tried the wax melts and then the home fragrance. And to me, it's one of the strongest ones, and it just is a year-round scent. It just has a very good smell to it. We finished a Skittles candle, and I guess is this it. This is a different one. I know that we had... Um, a green, green one, I can't remember what, it was it watermelon or apple? apple? I think it was apple. But anyway, this is the box, this is a cherry one. I think that I did finish the cherry one as well, or this might still be in the, in the bathroom. It's in the bathroom. It is, we're not finished with this one, so I'm going to keep this. But we did finish the apple, and it was really good. It's very, very light, but for a dollar, you can't beat it. And it, I mean, it, it, to me, it's a very good, the, um, the Dollar Tree candles to me are really good in the restroom. I really do like them in there because it's a small area and it fragrances it really well. Um, this was one of my favorites. This is one that actually, I don't even know if you remember it, but my husband actually helped me pick this one out at Bath and Body Works when we were there a couple of months ago. This was Pumpkin Latte and Marshmallow Comfort. Can you smell that? It was a very good scent. I have the um, lotion that I'm finishing up. I'm using it as a hand cream. It's in my purse because I'm at the very end of it. And I want to savor it. But it is one of the best fall scents that Bath & Body Works has come out with. I would repurchase it over and over again. To make a long story short, they actually sold out of this one. They had like three different ones in different scents that they released um, for fall. And this was the one. they You cannot even find the um, fine fragrance mist even on their website. I mean, it sold out very quickly. I had the girl looking in the store for me. Some and, you know, we just weren't able to... Um, to find it, I finished this Perversion Urban Decay uh, Mascara. This came in my Ipsy bag. You guys know I subscribe to Ipsy and I love it. And, um, shoot. But anyway, this is what the brush looks like and it's completely dried out. With mascara, you know, you're supposed to replace them after three months, but this was really, really nice. I'm tempted to, to clean off the brush and reuse just the brush. Because it was really that good. It gave me volume. It gave me length. I loved it for my, for my, um, and it didn't make, some, um, volumizing mascaras and stuff make your eyes look, have that spidery look and it did not make my eyes look funny or anything. So I would repurchase it again. I just got some of the mascara on my finger. That's what I'm trying to like get it off. But anyway, yeah, it was really good. And I don't want to get this anywhere. So I'm going to just kind of stick it somewhere. Okay. Um, I finished this, um, I won this on Brandon Molina's, um, giveaway, and this is the shower gel in, um, pomegranate lemon cream. I would repurchase this again, as you can see, there's a little water. I always stick water in it to get the rest of it out, and sometimes that water ends up staying in there. Um, I'm trying to keep this under five minutes. This is not finished yet. I finished one of these. These are from Dollar Tree. Um, these are good for like facial hair and also for cleaning up the brows and I would repurchase those over and over. I have a bunch more. Um, I finished a couple of little samples. One is a Shiseido um, 
it's a serum that I got from Sephora. I would not repurchase it because it's really expensive, but I was glad to try it. And then I finished an Arbonne Intensive Renewal Serum, which was really good. Arbonne is really good for your skin. And the Night Repair Cream. And then also the eye cream. And I believe the toner. Yeah, the toner's in here. And then the facial cleanser. So it's like a little kit that I got from actually a bridal show. I ended up loving the um, skincare, but it's really expensive. So I would not repurchase those. I can't justify that when I find stuff at the drugstore that works just as well. Um, that's not finished. I finished this cocoa butter formula. And this is a skin therapy oil sample. Um... I don't think that I would repurchase it. I have tried some other oils that I feel did better on my skin, even for a drugstore. Um, so I would never purchase that. For Dove Deep Moisture, um, I got this body wash. It's a free sample. Um, Y'all know I get a lot, a ton of things for free. Um, I absolutely love this. It's supposed to be a new formula, and it's just, it, Dove always smells really good. It's sensitive, good for sensitive skin. Um, I actually just bought a new bottle at Big Lots for like five dollars, which is like two or three dollars less than Walmart. So I would repurchase um, that again. I finished this Nourish Organic Face Lotion, and it's a 0 0.5 fluid ounce. I would um, debate ordering this. It was really good on my skin. I didn't really like the smell though, so I, I would not repurchase it. And then um, I'm not I'm working on this. So. Those are all of my empties. I know I had a bunch of different things, but I wanted to show you guys all of the things that I finished. You guys, hopefully I'm feeling better and can do some more videos very, very soon. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.